What is going on guys? Skip here and welcome back to another episode in our Road to Glory series. Today we're back with round nine of the English County Cup. We head to the central county ground to take on Sussex in what should be an absolute cracker. We sit on top of the ladder with seven wins, one loss, Sussex three and four. And they'll be looking forward to putting in a big shift today. The RDB himself, well, we're 83 overall. We took some wickets. We need to make some more runs. So hopefully after a bit of a rest in the second innings, last episode we're fit and firing and ready to go grab yourself a cold one ladies and gents get your feet up this is a career robin de bank it's a 90 rated sussex team and an 89 rated nottinghamshire team still don't have the captaincy shaheen stewart broad robin de bank that is a fair three fast man attack in some recent news we have just been given the contract offer for the tassie tigers we take the captaincy with that as well so we're down under for another season sussex get the toss in this one she's a dry hard wicket 13 degrees a little bit of breeze and we are going to have a bowl rightio robin let's go get that duke and swing her round corners a shout out to malto and wayno good to see him overcast conditions here but that's a deep Decent start for the home side. 138 wickets at an average of 22. The field is, well, it's not the one that he wants, but it's the rules they do apply. The first one in is going to go to Hodge. He's going to let that one through the keeper. The good signs early. That ball is swinging. Three slips, a gully, and we're full, and Hodge is back. We're a little bit all over the joint last match. We did get a bit of tap early doors as we're in, and yep, I'm liking this. The rhythm seems to be there today. Not going over the top as we're in, and we're getting driven. Solid five dots. Hopefully, Shaheen gives us a spell here as we get driven to the man at extra cover this time. Nine are in the book. Our first is as well, and Sussex are 36 for now. It'd be nice if we could just get the first one. You know what I mean? Oh no, we're going to get the first ball of our second driven on the up through cover. It's a vacant area, a good shot. We'll cop that on the chin. You can just see if you're not full enough and allowing that Duke to swing, they're going to pounce as we get driven down the ground this time. That's probably a better shot. Not enough power behind it and they'll come back for two. They hodge off to a good start. They're actually flying here, going at four and a half and over as we find some shin. Can Wayno give us a dodgy? No. Just kicking it outside that line of off. This time we're in, boy, there is some zing in that rock. 154 kilometers an hour. As we get shuffled across by Hodge, he takes the single. It closes the 11th. That is a wild throw. Sussex are 47 for none. Just the two overs in the spell, brother. Ew, that is vile. 90 runs are on the board. One wicket is taken. We've got a left-hander at the crease, and that is nice. So Haynes, 10 off 14. There's no point. There's no cover. We'll get the outie going, and he's trapped back. He's going to take the single direct hit, and he's gone. No, no one wants it. Two left-handers at the crease. This is good. Oh, and we're clubbed down the ground. That is even better. All goes bang. All making this look easy. They might be enjoying the pace here. Get whipped to forward square. That's going to close out the 23rd. And Sussex are 96 for one. Haven't quite got it going to the lefties. We'll get the out swingers in for this fourth. And there you go. He just opens the hands, eases it through point. We'll adjust this field accordingly. Hopefully that edge can come. The slip comes out and goes to a cover point. Width on offer. And he slashes straight to that man. Good captaincy. Just want to play every single ball. Oh, that's the line we need. That is perfect. We have another quick spell. Why is Shaheen doing this to us? Has he got the Kazakhstani bookmakers involved? The fifth over in here. We're going to get pressed to forward point. It's 121 for one as well. Can't quite put this together. Or is on 58. Shuffles across and clips her down the fine leg for one. Frustration creeping in. I don't know. Oh, it would be after that. Haynes rocks back and goes smoke through mid-wicket for four. Said that this was going to be a tricky matchup. Sussex need that win as we go full. Stamina good. None for 20 off five. First short ball is in and it's worked again through mid-wicket. The boys aren't messing around. This looks like a good 
Wicket to bat on as well. Are they back for three? They are direct. It'll have him no. Half decent partnership. The 50 is up for them. Out swinger is nice, and that is a beautiful on drive. You cop that on the chin. That's great four day cricket. Ooh, hopefully, we've got a couple of those when we get our opportunity with the bat as we go short. Oh, has it gone onto the stumps? It hasn't. We have a great ability to turn it on when we don't get off to a good start. We go short again. He's underneath. He's just starting to lose some stamina. Two balls left in the six. He's leaving that on the ribs. And we go and have a word with him as well. Well, I don't mind if this gets hit for four or six. The in-swing in Yorker. Oh, that's beautifully bowled. And though the short stuff is coming, hanging back on their tippy toes. We go short and he's underneath again. He's trying to raz this Outlaws lineup up. F cutter is nice. We find the edge and it's four. Probably thinking come around the wicket. Our plan is working here. We're keeping them accountable as we get slashed to cover point again. Frustration building. Not too sure about the light at this venue, but we'll get through. Last of the over is in. Oh, you're kidding me. He just watches it. The boys have been smoking. 37 are done. It's 151 for one. Stewie Broad gets the call up. We're going to continue into our ninth here, and it's just easy pickings for him at the moment. We'll take Gully out. He's no good in there. We'll go leg slip. Oh, and we crunch through mid wicket. Haynes is on fire. For the last of the ninth and probably the spell, Haynes looks to rock back. It's a dot ball. 39 are done, and it's 158 for one. Just the quick spell. Stamina. Looks good. We've taken a wicket. It's 170 for two, and it's about now that they need the RDB as we get clobbered through backwards square, and there's just more runs conceded. Change of angle is here. We'll start over 11. We'll go short. We'll find his neck again. Going to have to press back and try and defend this with the bat. Oh, you're kidding me. It's going to be a gutsy 100 if he gets there. He's going to with shots like that. That is vile. Vile. I don't want to say it, but we kind of look scared bowling at the moment. As we get clobbered down the ground, that's a low full toss. He's going to have four more and get 288. Once again, just another quick spell. I'm not happy with this. It's 205 for two or on 93. And he smokes us down the ground again for four. This is beautiful batting. Well, we're going to have to react to that shot. Mid-off goes back to the ring. Now he gets across the line and brings up his 100 with a pull shot. Robin DeBank needs to sort it out. Well, that's one of the better 100 you'll see. You won't see us celebrating three figures for the opposition, but man. So forget the pace. We're going to the cutters. See if we can get one to drag. Oh, we do. And again, he just picks it up and he's... Found himself the Toblerone. Good comeback over. We're simmed all the way through. Shaheen's taken a couple of wickets and look at that score. 252 for seven. We've got none for 62, but we've got a lefty on strike and Garten's leaving. And it just hasn't been consistent. We've found no flow. Shaheen's been a bit of a goose and Garten's concussed. Well, you got to take the good with the bad sometimes, ladies and gents. That's just cricket. As we get schnick to second slip. Bump ball, good hands. Hot hands in the cordon when this bloke's bowling. Oh, Garten goes bang through mid-wicket. Tell you what, if he's doing that, it must be a good bat and deck. We haven't lost it to the left-hander. I feel like the left-hander's just been good. Oh, and they keep playing that shot. Why have I not put a man there the whole time? This is pathetic. Pathetic. The leg slip comes out, and we fill mid-wicket. There you go. Cleaner thought patterns here as we hit Garten on the pad first up. There you go. We take away that shot. Wayno's in the game, and we've got an LBW. Well, Georgie boy, you need to go. This is brilliant. All we needed to do was just change the field. It swung back nicely. I mean, Wayno didn't even have to really think about it. The seam is brilliant. Garten thought, oh, that is salmon trout, ladies and gents. So one for 69, feeling fine. Was that the answer to all our issues? I don't know, was Carson's forward. And he defends his first. Ah, Mrs. Skip ensured me everything will be all right. And there you go. She's just got the magic touch. Join the Wicked Club. Last of the 17th, in swinging Yorker is a bump ball to second slip. 77 are done, and it's 263 for eight. a schnick through Gully. 14 off 27. And there's the schnick to the keeper. Thank you very much. It finally pays off. Wayno is working hard in the last five minutes, and we've got number two.
Well, this was fast, full, didn't worry about swing. And there you have it. First slip would have gobbled it, but don't worry. Tom Moores is on all fours. He takes a good catch. Crocom gone for 14. Shawnee Hunt, legs 11 in. And our figures look half respectable. We're going to go fast and full again. Does he drive? He does. He knocks him over. There you have it. We're on a hat trick to start the second dig. And the big RDB's got three. Well, that has gone through him just like last night's curry. I need to have a look at this highlight. Is it going to let me know? 269 all out Sussex, and we have bought that back beautifully. Shawnee Hunt's going to get ready to rock and roll to the opening batsman, but ladies and gents, you deserve a replay. Did he drag it on? I don't know. Look at that ball. It nipped back. Oh, yeah, he found the inside edge. See you later, cuz. You're gone first up. We're going to sim through to when we are going to bat. Can the top order make some noise? The seed gets 66. Duck at 75. It's 225 for six. We've got the long sleeves and the vest on. An average of 44 or 45. Patterson White is 10 off 16. Crocom's got three for 28. Can we get forward and defend? Absolutely we can. Well, we've got plenty happening we trail by 44 the last of the 63rd it's floaty from croaking we get through and the score stays at 225 for six so a nice little fight back it's a confidence booster that's a length ball we lean on that and launch it through the vacant cover region a taste of their own medicine here sussex and the big fellas off the mark well if he's gonna deliver that floaty trash i'll tell you what Lock and load. He gives us another one. We find the man at extra cover. Unlucky. Kind of got a little too shot heavy early doors last innings. We've got to get back. Oh, we've schnicked off. We've schnicked off. We've schnicked off, ladies and gents. Oh, my days. Momentum hasn't shifted. Crocom's got us. And that is the end of Robin DeBank. Oh my days. You are so lucky we've picked up three with the ball. We've got four with the bat. Stuart Broad is in and this game is going to get interesting. Oh dearie me. This is probably the form slump of our career at the moment. And I don't know what we are going to do about it. Nottinghamshire all out 235 in the 66th. Crocom stays on four. Garten gets three. And that is going to set us up for a massive second innings. Ladies and gents, we are going to leave it there for today's episode. Sussex have a lead of 103. I mean, you take the good with the bad and the bad with the good. They got on top of us early. They did it last match. And maybe teams are just starting to do their homework. We're slumping with the bat. I don't know how we're going to go about it, but we need to get in the nets and do something before the fourth innings. But if you have enjoyed today's episode, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. Leave a cheeky comment down below and make sure you swing over and catch us in one of our live streams. But until the next time, look after yourselves and those around you. And I'll catch us in the next one.